Hi all, it's Ali here and I've got some stuff to show you and share with you. It's been a while since I did a video so I thought I'd do a bit of a catch up. It's a beautiful hot sunny day here so I hope the glare isn't too much you know behind me. I wanted to show you this photo first of all. You can see here I had two chairs, got them out in the garden, decided to take the tops off and I had none of the right equipment to do <laughs> the job with. So I just had to make do. I couldn't go out and buy anything because obviously we're on lockdown still. So these chairs are beautiful. Actually, they're beautiful old fashioned chairs. But what can I do? I managed to take the, the top bit off. And um, then what I did was I had some old cushions here and I used those for the tops. But I had to also get my son just to cut me a square bit of two by, I think that's, I don't know what that is, but it's just a, a bit of boarding. And I was thinking, oh God, he's put it on a little bit close to the edge. But in fact, when I put the cushion on and put a bit of cotton on top, and then I used some normal nails just to bang around the edge and I just tucked the sides in, they've come out really well. So here you are, I had a, a back piece as well that I'd made that I slid on. And so, yeah, I was really pleased with the end result. I think they came out really well, considering I had none of the right, you know, equipment. Of course, our little dog Rolo just lay there exhausted in the sun. He uh, had different ideas. So I thought that I'd share that with you. That's just something that I've been, uh, another little thing that I've been doing while in lockdown. Um, this is another thing that I've made. It's a thing. It's a necklace. Again, I have had only half of the right stuff to make it with. So I had to sort of add some different cord. I had, I started off with this black cord here. And then as I, and I did a, uh, what's called a square knot and added little pearl beads. And I had to take apart another piece of jewellery because I couldn't go and buy any beads because we're on lockdown. <laughs> but just about here, can you see, I had to change to a, a, a waxy black um, type of thread, which isn't quite as thick. So it didn't, it doesn't actually show. And at the end, while I got to, the, I put a button as a, it actually undoes. This is just a little button. So if I can, I'll show you. Yeah, it goes through a little loop that I made at the end. And then what I did is I stitched a load of pearls around that bit. As it happens, I didn't need to make an opening because it goes over my head anyway. But it's just another little bit of crafting. You know, you've got to find things to make and use up the time well because otherwise you get so freaking bored 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 that's got to be the word uh, you know unprecedented isn't my word it's bored i want to see people i want to see my friends i want to see my friends i want to see my friends did i say that three times just in case you're wondering i'm desperate to see my girlfriend <laughs> so these are the things i keep myself entertained with now what else have i been doing uh I went on Pet Idol. Well, I did. Toby helped me with what was needed um, because I couldn't do the dog and I'm not very good at picking up links and stuff like that. I tried the day before on Vinnie G put out a link and I thought, well, it would be quite funny just to see if I could get in. I got in. I have no idea actually how I did it and I probably couldn't do it again if I tried. But with the Pet Idol, I know that they wanted people coming on Shoot the Shit Show. I, they wanted people coming in quickly. And I couldn't be faffing around going with a dog in one hand, a cat in the other, and, you know, trying to do, you know, grab a link. I'm just not, I'm just not, I'm just not good enough. I'm not. I hold my hands up. I'm technically challenged, okay? The fact that I can even... Is it download or upload? Am I downloading or upload? It doesn't matter. The fact that I can even get um, a video onto a YouTube channel and have a tiny, tiny little channel 
it's really quite remarkable. That's as far as my learning's gone. So I don't know what else to say. As far as my whisk situation's gone, if anyone saw the last video, um, yes, I gave it a ceremonial burial in the bin and I've had to go to one of the other three or four whisks, which I didn't like. And they are ones that used to attach onto an electrical gadget. I'm still looking for the electrical gadget. I think there, I think I've got one, but the problem is, so when I put the two whisks in the bottom to turn the gadget on that make, gives it the electrical whisk thing, one drops out always so i don't know so i tend to just use by hand because i can't be bothered this week i'm on a cut down of eating i know a lot of people have been overeating i mean let's face it we're in lockdown i'm trying so hard not to overeat the problem is i'm bored and i can hear all the snacks calling me from the fridge now I know that other people have this struggle and I think if anybody says they've lost weight over this lockdown well first of all go to hell <laughs> I don't want to hear that and secondly how did you do it because actually I'm fuming I can't I just can't get my mind off food it's all I'm thinking about between that so this is why i have to make things like this i'm wishing you all well i hope you've enjoyed this stream video whether uploading downloading whatever you want to call it i uh and i hope that for those of you that did see pet idol oh my goodness those pets were gorgeous just gorgeous and uh i watched it two or three times um, just because I was fascinated. That bird was so pretty. Oh my God. I think it belonged to Granny Takes a Trip. Oh my God. That bird was, the colours were fabulous on that birdie. What can I say? And I, I haven't seen a, a, those, I don't know what they were, little animals. I can't remember what they called them, gliders or something. Never seen those before. So they were really interesting. Um, and so nice to have a, just the non-drama ch channel. To be honest with you, um, isn't it wonderful that animals calm us all down? Or for most of us, some of us don't, but I find it very calming having an animal. And I can't imagine my life without my animals. So just thought I'd end with that. Anyway, take care, keep safe, be sensible. Love you all. Bye-bye.